Good morning. Today's Wednesday, June twenty first, twenty seventeen, and we're doing the morning business headline commentary. The news overnight was that、uh, it was announced that Uber CEO、uh, Travis、um, resigns as CEO,、um, so he remains on the board of directors. That's good and bad, you know.、Uh, we already know that Travis knows how to hustle. Uh, making things、uh, into number one, remaining number one, but the thing is, he he offends a lot of people. So, yeah, and we do see the new management、um, implementing 180 days of changes, which is nothing of changes. What people ask for from Uber is to decrease commissions. To be on par to with other startups like ten percent, like Via and Get. They never answer that. Um. Then also they have to try to heighten the、uh, miles rate. They never answer that. So they you know skip hopping the new management skip hopping on little stuff like tipping. Um, like uh, like a waiting window time shortening. Nobody cares about that. The major thing they care about is lowering the commission rate to ten percent, and also heightening to heightening the miles rate. Um, from the deflationary thing that happens year after year. Well, that's that. Um, so that's that with the、uh, Uber CEO resigning. Uh, Saudi King surprises shake up, clear Sun's path to the throne. That's fine.、Um, it's not gonna change anything about the oil situation. The new perspective in oil use is decrease consumptions and increase production.、Um, decrease meaning that you have a lot of acceptance of hybrid cars and even electric cars, and in the future there may be triple hybrid. Um, where you use electric,、um, traditional gas, and hydrogen, which is pioneered by Toyota. Triple hybrid would be very interesting. Investors swarming into the world's most expensive ETF. You know, ETF is much more safe. Um, because individual stocks can get hacked, meaning that they can be manipulated in price by a lot of, as you know,、um, algorithmic trading, high frequency trading, some guy with a lot of authority to use funds to manipulate the price. So if you have ETF where it bunches up a bunch of、uh, other stocks together in the same industry or something like that. It's harder to hack the price, so that's why ETF is more popular. All right, let's go to.、Um Again,、um, Uber CEO resigns. Whole Foods and the Amazon saga again. What、well, unless I mentioned before, buying something doesn't mean much unless you proven its worth、um, in the later implementations of ideas.、Uh, they recently said that they may lay off the cashiers. And implement the、uh, Amazon's like you take it out,、um, and then they charge you automatically. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know how that would work in New York City, and that would be like an invitation of all the bums that to come in and take anything they want and walk out, and pretending that they pay for it. That would happen in New York City.
where the bumps would come in and stuff. <laughs> Four is moving production on the fourth focus from Michigan to China. Because uh, they're already producing four focus there already for the China market. So they will import the cars from there. China shares get MSCI not in their moment for Beijing. Yeah, that's fine. You need to clean up the um, shady reporting, a lot of the other stuff. Um, yeah, that's a slow migration um, to MSCI. Uber adding tipping feature matching lift. Yeah, people did not really ask for that. They were more like asking for lower commission. Um, and also higher fair rate, fair rates instead of the deflationary situation that you see. You know, the nonsense that he talks about, he's good at talking about stuff. Uh, with Jack Ma. You, you, this is the guy that talks a lot, but doesn't have the technical knowledge. And a lot of employees are disillusioned, thinking that he actually knows what he's talking about. Well, you know, you fake it till you make it. That's my opinion on that thing. Nike selling stuff on Amazon. Alright. Let's go to CNBC. Take a look. Dow Jones down a little bit. Not too much. As I mentioned before, there's a lot higher, higher than, you know, less, lower much less lower lowers with the Dow Jones and you see like uh, it's good for a thousand points um, higher from to 2200 for the promise of the tax cut from the president um, yeah Going to you. As I mentioned before, Hang Seng is nearing, may near um, 30,000, but never reach it. May near it. Is election hacking hearings to focus on state level events. Well, you know, a lot of these elections still use paper trails, so it's very limited on the hacking. I can tell you that. Well, you know, with these uh, elections, if the voter receive a receipt, a copy of a receipt that is uh, redundant on both ends, the receipt for um, voting. They can do a recount or a verification recount where the voters come in with the receipt or a copy of the receipt being held by the voting uh, facility to do the recount. So you need to be a federally regulated kind of thing with these um, modern voting situation setups where voters get a receipt and the voting facility retains a copy of the receipt as well.
Well, SoftBank is uh, investing $100 million in Boston based cybersecurity, owned by former Israeli counterintelligence. This thing right here, well, you know, you fake it till you make it. Um, so, SoftBank, you know, not too smart about this. Yeah, I don't think that area or that background is uh, legit. But they they were fooled into doing that. That's fine. We we'll, we we'll continue to read news like that. All right, <clears throat> that's basically um. Today's commentary for Wednesday, June 21st, 2017. Some things to note. Um, Modi went for a big hug on Amazon after I featured Amazon in one of my videos. Um, uh, Chinese investors bought out a Germany uh, robotics firm after I featured these robotics on my e e I mean, supercar videos. Um, building supercars. Um... Like I mentioned, I do have Indian followers and I do have Chinese business followers. Um, and also I featured McDonald's last year. And right now it's at an all-time high because of my experience patronizing McDonald's. First mentioning the McPick 2, 2 bucks each. Now they basically raised it, the price by 50% to McPick 2 for $3.00. That's fine. That's fine. I applaud their strategy in doing that. Um, that's they actually raise the revenue by fifty percent by doing that. Um, and also more recently, the company called Funimation that owns Dragon Ball um, got taken over, uh, and because I featured Goku and Gohan in my e eating video, um, which are cooking hero demos, which are listed below. Alright, today's uh, um, the commentary, and happy trading everybody.